If you're planning to park at the Indianapolis airport over the next few days for that flight, then you may want to reroute your plans. The airport is expecting to see a record number of travelers, and it's also running out of parking spaces. Yeah, it's a big problem for some people. Fox 59's Jenny Dreisler joins us to explain what people are already dealing with and why it's gotten so bad now, Jenny. Well, Dana Beershell, we all know when you're headed to the airport, you need to get there at least two hours early. Well, airport officials tell me that's even more important since parking is at a premium. Inside the Indianapolis International Airport Friday night, the hustle and bustle of a busy weekend was well underway. Meanwhile, outside, cars circling, looking for places to land or park. Yeah, the garage is full. Um, we did find a spot in the economy lot. Um, and then it was kind of one of the, we didn't have to drive around too long, but we were lucky we got in there and then got on the bus and everything. More than 20,000 passengers are expected at the airport between October 11th and the 16th, the most in the airport's history. We planned accordingly, so we came early Sunday morning and got here about three hours early, so it wasn't that bad. But we had a lot of people tell us that Monday was worse. The airport expects parking availability to be full or scarce this weekend for fall break. Well, it just makes you panic a little bit because you know you're supposed to be boarding by a certain time and you're, you know, the whole time you're checking your watch to see what time it is and make sure you're going to make it. When we were at the airport Friday night, only 26 spots were left open in the parking garage. Part of the parking garage is under construction and the rest of the five story lot fills up fast. The airport is urging travelers to park in economy and complimentary overflow lots or use a ride share and get dropped off at the airport. When we were driving through, you could tell there were signs up that things were full already. And while it may cause some headaches, many travelers say they'd rather see the airport full than empty. And the economy needs it, so the traveling is good. And luckily, we're through COVID and all those things, so everybody's probably excited to get out and travel and take their kids on fall break. I'm excited because I like to go, and I'm, that means that everything is, seems to be going well and people are actually getting out and doing things again. Now, no one can say if this situation will pop up again during the upcoming holiday travel season. By the way, construction on that parking garage expansion is expected to wrap up in late spring or early summer of 2024. Jenny Dreisler, Fox 59 News. All right, so hopefully right